life is so short. Life only has only a little time. Although it will continue to go on, but you cannot hold on and think that every day is promised to you. We have all experienced great losses in our life. We have all felt that pain of losing a loved one, someone that we cared about. But yet we're still here. And now we must go on. But what is the example that we're going to leave? What kind of leadership and what kind of leadership quality do we have? How do we go on? How do we lead the next generation? Hate is not going to make it work. Be afraid to be truthful to who you are will only limit who you truly are inside. Don't let anyone take that away from you. Don't let anyone take away who you are and how true you are and what you matter in this world to so many other people. Don't be afraid to be honest. Don't be afraid to be truthful. Don't be afraid to be different. Even being different can be difficult to a lot of people. But I guarantee you this, there's nobody in the world that can do you. When the time comes, what would you leave behind? What legacy will be left behind to remind others of your greatness, of your losses, of your victories, of your sorrows. This is a short life that we all have. And it's not easy. It's not easy living it every day. It's not easy to go through so many different circumstances, so many different challenges. It's not easy getting that deep slip, knowing that this may be your last day on your job. It's not easy knowing that you may lose your home because you got laid off your job. This type of pain and these different circumstances, many people are always going to come back and say, well, that's life. We cannot blame life. It is not life that makes these challenges what they are today. It is the purpose. And purpose never lies. It will always tell you the truth. But while you exist in this world right now, I need you to hold on. I need you to hold on strong and don't give up. I need you to believe in every possibility that you have and understand that it is not over for you. I need you to understand life is always going to be good. But always keep in mind, sooner or later, we all got to punch that club. So carry on. And don't give up. And don't give in. Do the best that you can to have the right attitude to make your existence matter. Your existence is not by accident. Your existence has so much meaning. Are you ready to take on the unknown? Are you prepared for it? You can't even understand, in most cases, how beautiful it is sometimes to not even know what's coming your way. Sometimes it's not necessary to know everything. Sometimes it's not necessary to understand everything. 
But are you ready? Are you ready to embrace the fact that someday, life as you know, life as I know, will soon come to an end? Now, what are you going to do about what you're doing with the life that you have right now? See, I talk about life because life is such a great thing. Life is such a beautiful thing. Life has so much university to it. It is unexplained to some people. It is unimaginable to some people. Sometimes you may even ask yourself, I don't even deserve this life. Sometimes you may even ask yourself, why am I suffering so much from this? And that person over there is not suffering as much as I am. Ladies and gentlemen, life, your existence, is temporary. It won't last forever. And if you're sitting around wasting it, if you're sitting around being hateful, you're sitting around being jealous, if you're letting things outside of your circle control your possibilities, your uniqueness, your qualities, your principles, who you really are inside, then what's gonna happen next? There will come a time when you leave this world and they're gonna put you in that hole and guess what, ladies and gentlemen? No one is gonna jump in that hole with you. No one is gonna jump in there with you and celebrate that death that you just experienced. Yes, I know, it may sound a little harsh. In fact, it may even scare you. But you can't fake this. You can't hide from this. Life is short. And the only thing that's beautiful about it is that when you're living, you have strong possibilities. You have something that you can be doing to make it impactful for others to see. You can't stop. You can't stop living. You can't stop growing. You can't stop fighting. You have to understand that yesterday and today and tomorrow are in three different universes. The only universe you exist in right now is the now. Is this moment? Is this reality? can't fix anything that's already been broken. Some things can mend in time. Some things are better off left alone. There are a lot of negative people right now that exist in this world. And there are people that are going to watch this video. There are people that are watching this video right now. There are people that are listening to this message right now. And yet, they'll still find something that is not making them happy. You must make peace within your heart. You must make peace within your spirit. Life is so short.